Hey beauties, welcome back. Thank you so much for stopping by. If it's your first time here, welcome to Sean's World. I am Shauna, but you can call me Sean's for short. Thank you so much for stopping by. Today I have a haul for you. It's a beauty and a little bit of blingage. So yeah, let's get into it. So to kick off this beauty haul, I'm going to show you some things that I picked up from TK Maxx. You know, that's one of my favorite stores ever because I always find some good deals. So the first thing I want to share with you are some stuff I picked up from Makeup Forever. Yes, I said Makeup Forever. Can you believe TK Maxx sells Makeup Forever products? Yes, they do. So I'm going to start off with this. It's called the Artistic Essentials and it looks a little something like this. And it has a, they're all mini by the way, so it has a skin equalizer, it has a high defi definition powder, it has a mascara and a black, also a black eyeliner pencil and a gloss. So this is what it looks like and these are the items that are in this. So let's open this up right quick. And when you open it up, it looks like this. How beautiful. Oh my goodness, the packaging is to die for. So it's whatever you call this, a tin case. And when you open it, these are the little bad boys. Let me turn it this way, sorry. These are the items in it. So you have the, um, this is basically the primer, the high definition powder, the eyeliner, which is a black one, I think. That's a mascara and a lip gloss. So this is a perfect little gift for like a giveaway or if a gift or, you know, Christmas is coming up. So make sure you go check out TK. But I love this. And of course, I cannot wait to try it out. But I mean, the packaging, amazing. Yeah. So the second thing from Makeup Forever is also in a pack in the same packaging. I don't know if this is their holiday version or what edition, but I really like the packaging. It's in nice tin case and you can store other bits in it if you don't feel like you want to store your, you know, your makeup forever items. So this is their eyeshadow palette and this one is called, I'm sorry, this one is called the Artistic Palette and it has nine eyeshadows in it and these are what are in the case. Oh, so, yep, I can see me playing around with these. I'm going to swatch them for you guys, but these are absolutely beautiful and I can imagine the pigmentation is going to be off the wall. You know, Makeup Forever is known for their high pigmentation, so I can imagine how beautiful this is going to be. So I'll swatch it for you guys in a minute. But as I said, I love the packaging and listen to this, listen to this. So the eyeshadow palette, yeah? It retails usually for £40 and I got it for sixteen ninety nine. The Artistic Essentials, it's usually at the price of £35 and I got it for £12.99. So whatever you're doing, drop it and go straight on to TK Maxx. Let's move on. Okay, some other bits and pieces that I picked up from TK are these two Ciate Case Collection Liquid Velvet. Now I purchased one of these... I want to say two years ago and oh my goodness they are absolutely beautiful Ciate lipsticks are amazing and the thing about these is that you have to use them quickly because if you keep like opening them they will dry up on you and they're minis so they do dry dry up in the bottle very quickly but I absolutely love these this this one has like a, an orangey red a pink and a kind of a nudish pink this one has a red nudish pink and whatever that color is called but they're absolutely beautiful and these of course make great gifts for christmas and i think this is the one i picked up about two years ago and i still have it but they're a bit dry now which is fine because i did get a good use out of them but these are absolutely beautiful and they usually retail for 16 pounds and i got them for 4.99 each so make sure you go check these out absolutely beautiful i love Ciate. They are an amazing brand. Okay, so I think we're done. No, we're not done with TK. Oh, I picked up this NYX blush and it's called Bordeaux. Let's see if I can get it open first. I might need a sledgehammer, but yeah, be patient. I can't 
get it open. Ah, <sighs> so this is what the blush looks like. I don't tend to use a lot of blushes lately. I mean, this one from Inglot is my absolutely favorite blusher of all times. And quite frankly, I don't feel like buying blushes because I always gravitate towards this one. I absolutely love it. It's just, it's so beautiful and it gives a really nice glow. So I always use this. Keeping in the spirit of NYX, I picked up their concealer and this one is in the shade Nutmeg. I thought it would have been much darker, but this is, it's, and it's quite creamy. It's not the easiest to blend out, but this is what it looks like. So I use it for like highlighting a bit. If I don't want my highlight to be too strong, I'll use this to highlight, but I really like it. It's creamy enough. It can be a bit drying, but I use oil to, you know, help with the dryness. So I really like it. And as I said, I use it for days when I don't want such a strong highlight. So I picked up some face scrubs and these are from Seventh Heaven and I absolutely love these. I mean, I always use them. These are like my weekend facial pamper session must-haves. <laughs> So I got this one, which is a black seaweed and it's a peel off. This one is a Dead Sea Mud and it says here deep pore cleansing and it's a hard drying mask. And of course, this one is, a, is another peel off and it says it cleanses and detoxifies. So I love these and they are like a pound each. So I always buy like 10 of them at once. So I really like these and of course I'll be doing my little pamper sesh over the weekend. So I might do a video on that. Let's see. Yeah. Okay, last thing guys for the makeup bit, the beauty bit. I picked up this wet and dry eyeshadow from Kiko. And I want you to tell me if you don't think this is a dupe for the Fenty highlighter called Trophy Wife. Tell me, please. It has, it's, look at that. Oh my goodness, it's absolutely beautiful. Let me see if I can find somewhere to swatch it. Hang on, hang on. Does this not resemble Trophy Wife? Tell me guys, because I've seen Trophy Wife and it has the same yellow tone to it. And I mean, this if, if it is a resemblance to, or a dupe to Trophy Wife, then definitely get this because it's much, much cheaper than Trophy Wife. But I absolutely, look at that. I mean, look at that. Absolutely beautiful. I cannot wait to use this. And the last things guys I wanna show you are these jewelry pieces I got from Pretty Little Things. Now I've been shopping there for a while now, but I bought some outfits and I really didn't like the material very much. So I sent them back. But I decided to try them out again. I mean, I tried them like three years ago before I started YouTube. And I decided to get back into Pretty Little Things because I've seen so many fabulous pieces. And I'm like, maybe they've changed their material or whatever. So let me go check them out. So I found these jewelry. And the first things I have to show you are these earrings. These lovely tassel earrings. They are very trendy at the moment. And I just love how sleek and how chic they look. And they are very, very lightweight. So I will leave the price on the screen so you guys can see how much they cost. And of course, I will leave the link to Pretty Little Things so you can go have a check at what they have. Another piece that I picked up from Pretty Little Things are, well, is this choker. And it has the circle bit in the middle. And this is what it looks like. You can even wear it with these hoop earrings so gorgeous and the thing is it's very lightweight as well i don't like those chokers that are quite heavy and uncomfortable so i like the fact that the this one is very light and the gold is not too gold if you know what i mean let me see if i can open it okay i don't know how to open this but i'll, I'll put it on for you guys and the last pieces I got, well, the last piece I got is this beautiful, I don't know what you call this, let's see. It's called a drop chain choker, yes. 
and I love this piece. Wow. So this is what it looks like. Mind you, they're a little bit hard to get open. Hmm. What's that about? So this is what it looks like. Of course, I will try these on for you so you can decide whether you like them or not. But this is, it goes all the way down to the navel or the past the navel, I'm not sure. But that's how it looks, it's absolutely beautiful. And they also have it in silver. So yeah, these are the things, all the things I have to show you today. I will leave the link to Pretty Little Things so you can go check out what they have. They really have some nice things on there and they have a sale going on. And you know, your girl loves a good sale. And if there's a sale going on, I'm gonna tell you about it. So we've come to the end of the video, guys. I hope you enjoyed watching. Let me know if you like the pieces I showed you. I mean, I got a steal of a deal when it came on to the Makeup Forever pieces. Wow, I when I saw them, I, I was like, I'm going to fight somebody. If anybody comes close to this, I'm going to have to punch somebody. But nobody came close. I grabbed it and I went straight to the tail and I cashed them out. I was so excited to show you guys. And of course, I'm excited about the pieces I got from Pretty Little Things. And I hope you go check them out. Of course, I will link them down below. So thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to thumbs up subscribe, share, turn your notifications on because you don't want to miss anything from Sean's. Did that rhyme? No. <laughs> well, thank you guys so much for watching. Have a wonderful, wonderful, fabulous day. Stay beautiful. Love you guys. Bye. Hi guys, welcome. No, that sounds a bit too frightened. Yeah. Let's abort that one. Yeah. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for watching. If it's your first time here, um, I forgot the words. Uh, hi beauties, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for watching. If you are new here, welcome back. No, if you can't say welcome back if you're new here, Sean's. What is wrong with you? Like, focus, okay? Do that little meditation thing that you do to get you, yeah, like, 